Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to know the reason why Shawn Mendes cancelled his Wonder Tour. Let's get right into it. On July 27th, Mendes officially cancelled the remaining shows, saying he wasn't ready to return to the road after so much time off due to COVID-19. What began as a three-week break from shows for Shawn Mendes turned out to be the end of the Wonder Tour. It all started on July 8, when Sean took to social media to announce that he was postponing the next three weeks of tour dates to focus on his mental health. The Stitches singer wrote, I started this tour excited to finally get back to playing live after a long break due to the pandemic. But the reality is, I was not at all ready for how difficult touring would be after this time away. Sean then added, After speaking more with my team and working with an incredible group of health professionals, it has become more clear that I need to take the time I've never taken personally to ground myself and come back stronger. Mendez then noted that the rest of his North American tour dates, as well as those in the UK and Europe, would be cancelled. He then continued, We were hopeful that I might be able to pick up with the rest of the dates after some much needed time off, but at this time I have to put my health as my first priority. This doesn't mean I won't be making new music, and I can't wait to see you on tour in the future. The Canada native concluded his statement by thanking his fans for supporting and sticking by him on his journey, while noting that he's focused on taking the right time to heal. The cancellation comes after the Treat You Better songwriter initially postponed the tour, announcing a three-week hold at the beginning of July. He wrote, After a few years off the road, I felt like I was ready to dive back in, but that decision was premature and unfortunately the toll of the road and the pressure has caught up to me and I've hit a breaking point. The singer then added, After speaking with my team and health professionals, I need to take some time to heal and take care of myself and my mental health, first and foremost. Mendez has been candid about the various ups and downs he's faced in the spotlight. The There's Nothing Holding Me Back artist admitted in April in a vulnerable note shared via social media that he constantly feels like he's either flying or drowning, believing that some of his insecurity possibly stems from being in his 20s. He wrote, Sometimes I ask myself what it is that I should be doing with my life and what I always hear in return is to tell the truth, to be the truth. I feel like that's a hard thing to do though. He then added, I'm afraid that if people know and see the truth, they might think less of me, they might become bored of me, so in those moments of feeling low, I either put on a show or hide. He went on to talk about his truth and how in his message he is just trying to be the truth. He wrote at that time, The truth, in current form, is a 23-year-old who constantly feels like he's either flying or drowning. Maybe that's just what it is to be in your 20s, I don't know, or maybe that's just me. He then wrote, the truth is, I really do want to show up in the world as my 100% true, honest, unique self and not care what anyone thinks. Sometimes I do. Sometimes I really don't care what people think and I feel free. Most of the time, it's a struggle though. That's the truth. He then added, The truth is even with so much success, I still find it hard to feel like I'm not failing. Hyper-focused on what I don't have, forgetting to see all that I do. The truth is, I'm overwhelmed and understimulated. Soon after, Sean followed up his very raw and emotional message with a tweet reaffirming his fans that he is alright, writing, I'm honestly so okay. I just want to communicate with you guys in a real honest way. So I just typed a big old note out for you. LOL. Meanwhile, the Grammy Award nominee who has just turned 24 kicked off his birthday weekend Saturday at LIV nightclub in Miami, where a source tells people he had an amazing time partying with The Weeknd during the Dawn FM artist's surprise performance. The insider said, Sean was in amazing spirits, adding that Mendez looks super happy to be there, relaxed and just enjoying the environment. He hung out in the DJ booth with his friends until the weekend arrived, at which point he and DJ K Tronada joined the artist on stage. Mendez was also photographed on the beach bar in a pair of red swim trunks, flaunting his physique. He posted photos on Instagram of himself and friends soaking up the rays on the back of a yacht. A source told people that Mendez is getting help for his mental health, explaining, Sean is a very sensitive and caring guy. The insider then added, When he gets frustrated with things around him, he turns inward and suffers. The insider then said, He said he is getting help, so that is admirable. Sean was also ambushed by TMZ and asked how he has been spending his time. He said, I'm taking a lot of time doing therapy, taking it easy man, spending time with family that I haven't been able to see. He then added, I think for me it's just been about spending time doing things I haven't really done over the last few years, having dinner with friends and stuff. Fans around the world believe that Shawn Mendes will recover very soon. That's it for today. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to hit that like button.
Don't forget to subscribe and turn on that notification bell so you never miss out on any future content we'll produce for you guys. We're signing off now, but we'll be sure to catch you all in the next one.